All right, so we got Galaxy S24 in hand, and not only do we have that, we also got the UAG Monarch Pro. Now, UAG Urban Armor Gear actually introduced this case, I wanna say last year, for the iPhones. And they have now brought this case over to the new Samsung devices. So let's talk. All right, so this is it. Uh, UAG has this casing, the Monarch Pro, in two separate versions. One is Kevlar, and the other comes in a carbon fiber. And it actually says it right here on the box. I just already taken this one out. Carbon fiber, other one, Kevlar. So different materials that you can get in this, and even in their other cases, they do have a leather interior. So you can take advantage of all of those different combinations, whatever you like. So the elephant in the room is, does the magnet affect this? We'll talk about it in just a little bit. Let's get it out. Now I do like this blue combination, kind of reminds me of like an Android or something. Look at it. Not like Android operating system, but like a robot Android. <laughs> Look at it, nice, sleek, I like that blue. On the inside, you only get the pattern, no color changing on the inside. You do get the honeycomb, effect also that's going to cushion your device if you drop it and also interwoven carbon fiber and interwoven kevlar in here so these are the most no i'm just i'm not gonna say bulletproof <laughs> but these are some really really protective cases down bottom everything matches up easy to get in and out on that s pen no problems there the little peekaboo, I don't know how I'm liking that because if I had a different color phone, it may go better. Let's put it in with the black. That little peekaboo look, I'm not liking that with the orange on that blue, but maybe the black on the orange. Yeah, much better. And it's still a little, it's a little awkward. I would have preferred just maybe a whole, whole, a whole, whole, <laughs> so that you have this whole thing just out and about but I kind of like the way that looks looks sleek looks terminator ish not much of a lip but you do have a lip all case all the time and I do have a tempered glass screen protector on here from Whitestone 9h hardness probably one of uh, the better screen protectors out there but that's what we got uh, got a little Goku picture. Screen is a little bright. Let's dim that down some. Uh, we did not test out our wireless charging. So, and our buttons. We definitely got to test out the buttons and the weight. Got to have the weight. Wireless charge. Is it plugged up? <laughs> okay. So I'm not getting a wireless charge out of this. Let's make sure we're plugged up. There we go. So we just had no power. Magnet, super strong. No problems there. Magnetic charging. Magnets are strong. No problem. Now, as for the weight. Phone itself, 8.3 ounces. You go up to 10.8 ounces on this device when you got it in your pocket. So you put a little bit more bulk onto it, but you are getting a layer of protection that's going to be a really efficient layer. Buttons, nice and tactile. No problems there. I like the way it looks. I like the way it feels. It's not slippery, not slick in the hands. And it does give you decent protection across top and across your camera. So I give this case a big thumbs up. Now remember, you can go out and pick this up in different configurations. Go by and check them out. I'll drop links below so you can do that. But until next time, hopefully this has been able to help someone out. Average Tech Guy out. Peace.